During a visit to Central Texas last spring, we met up with the collector showing off a rare piece of machinery. This week's tractor tail got its start back in 1941. This tractor is a 1941 uh, Hebbard A14 shop mule. Uh, WF Hebbard was a small company in Chicago that uh, basically they had contacted International Harvester in the late 1930s to get components so that they could build this type of tractor using uh, as many IH components directly as they could. Their original uh, purpose for it, uh, as stated, was for railroad uh, yard tugs to move uh, wagons around the yards, and then they got used for various uh, industrial purposes, uh, and you use them in shops and so on. It really is a fun to drive tractor. It handles very nicely, it's very maneuverable, uh, of course those were the characteristics that were deliberately designed into it, was to make it uh, uh, nimble and easy to move around in tight quarters. This particular tractor was made in 1941 and the only reason we know that is because the engine has the international engine number that would have been applied to a Farmall A so we can use the the engine numbers to track the year of it. I've done very little. Uh, there were a few mechanical things that I had to uh, work on and tweak it a little bit but uh, by and large it's uh, the way I found it it's a sufficiently rare tractor that it really does deserve a decent restoration, but I have so far just uh, kept it as much the way I found it as I could.